Hi, welcome to my channel, Spina Bifida Guide to Hope. My name is Leilani, and today I would like to talk about my Spina Bifida tattoo. Now, back when I recovered from my tethered cord surgery, I wanted to have a Spina Bifida tattoo to represent my journey with this disability. So, in October, which happens to be Spina Bifida Awareness Month, of last year the tattoo i decided to get is a daisy with the word warrior i will insert a picture right here i'm very interested in flowers especially because my name actually means heavenly flower and i didn't want to get a ribbon or a spine for a tattoo personally i wanted a flower so I did research and I came across the daisy and according to my research, each part of the daisy has a different meaning for people with spina bifida. To start, the center of the flower represents the brain and it represents people with spina bifida who also have hydrocephalus. Next is the petals. The petals of the daisy represent each scar that a person with spina bifida may have because of multiple surgeries. Lastly are the leaves and the stem. The leaves and the stem represent the differences in each person with spina bifida's spine and the different forms of spina bifida. Now also to do with a daisy. I had created a spina bifida challenge on the support group that I run called Spina Bifida Guide to Hope. And in this challenge, you either have to create a daisy by either drawing it or painting it or any other creative way if you are a crafty person, or you can take a picture of a daisy or you can share a meme that has a daisy in it. This challenge isn't only for members of the Spina Bifida support group, it is also for anyone who is viewing my YouTube channel and anyone who is following on any of my social medias like Twitter or Instagram, you can share with me the daisy you either created or had taken a picture of and tag me in it. Or if you are part of the support group on Facebook, you can do the challenge there and share it with the group. Now, this challenge does not only have to be in the group or shared with me on social media. It can also be posted on your personal pages, your personal social medias to spread awareness about spina bifida. All that is required, either than it being a daisy, is for you to hashtag your post with the hashtag Spina Bifida Daisy Challenge. I encourage you to do this challenge to help spread awareness about Spina Bifida. Thank you for listening. It's greatly appreciated. Please subscribe if you have not already to my YouTube channel down below and comment, like, and share this video. And I will see you next week. Bye!